All eyes are on college basketball right now, both men's and women's. But this Women's History Month, we're shining a light on a local high school team and its head coach who made history this year. WRTV's Nadja Woods shows how she's inspiring her team on and off the court. A high school 4A state championship win. So much bigger than basketball. To see young adults set a goal and have the courage to chase it, to sacrifice, to commit to it, um, phenomenal, phenomenal feeling. A dream turned reality for the Lawrence Central girls team, making history for their high school. It's showing young girls that we're still breaking down walls and barriers. Barriers that Coach Shannon Lampley also broke down herself, becoming the first black woman to lead an Indiana high school basketball team to a state championship. It's as special for me as it is for them. When they tell this story 10, 15 years from now, I'm blessed to be part of that chapter in their life. It's a moment the coach and her group of girls will always share. And for two of them, it's even more special. I'm just proud and I'm happy for her. Um, I, it's just great to see not only black women succeed, but your own mother on and off the court just as a woman. Like I look up to her and she lets me know that you can do so many things. For Lola and Jayla Lampley, this basketball season meant leaving it all out on the court for their coach, their mom, and their mentor. It's great to not only be a daughter to her in the house, but also on the court as well, and just being another leader and extending that same great example from her to my other teammates. One of those other teammates is junior point guard Layla Abduraki. Her bond with Coach Lampley is not biological, but has been unbreakable since she was eight years old. She definitely came in um, you know, YMCA basketball, second grade, didn't know what to do, didn't know, I used to be a gymnast, so for me, basketball was new, but she took me under her wing, and she was just an amazing role model. The state championship win was years in the making for Coach Lampley and her team. Last year, we made it to the finals, we lost, and finally, we got over that, and I think that just made them a little more hungry for more. That hunger, fueling a 30-0 and record on the season. The behind-the-scenes journey has just been wonderful to watch. Our student athletes, of course, and our coaches are putting a lot of work uh, to be where they're at. Coach Lampley leading the team to new heights with her head held high. Walked around with her chin high, smiling in her face, no matter, you know, any targets on her back. So she really inspired me. And that's kind of what got our team going, for sure. We all look up to her. Inspiration that goes beyond the basketball court. Just being her daughter and watching her help 12, and girls just succeed and all of us win state and I'm just so proud and happy. She's built a lot of things up. Um, she built me up as a person, as an individual, as a basketball player, um, as a young lady. So, you know, I just take that with me. Sometimes people don't always open the door. You just got to kick it down. Nadja Woods, WRTV. What a great story there. Well, Coach Lampley has been coaching for more than 20 years, but has only been leading the Lawrence Central Bears for two seasons. She says she's still soaking in all that they accomplished this season while looking forward to doing the same next season. A very good story there.